And I am, uh... <clears throat> hey, Chinese Potato. Good old standby from last game. Actually, it's more like the lantern fruit. Really was useful. Hot damn it, Lupus! I just got back! I can't believe you're doing this to me! Also, welcome on by, Subnautic. Yeah, lantern fruits were great. Shr <laughs> We're, uh, we're picking, we're picking some nuts. Just really, uh, firmly grasping them and twisting. <laughs> gotta, gotta really... Uh, you, you really gotta flick the wrist with the, uh, when harvesting. <laughs> uh... All right, I need to make some inventory room. Preston's delight. Thank you. Kind of funny if people ask me if my snake bites. Nah, the question you should ask is if she's gonna shit on you. <laughs> the sna snakes do be snakes do be pooping sometimes. Uh, it's also like I remember one time I thought a circuit breaker broke, but it was just one of my snakes like basically farting They can they can really let them rip when they want to Snakes don't be pooping much, but when they do be pooping they be pooping <laughs> All right Marge old girl we hate this greenhouse, so here are some pointers to remember so we never have to do the worst parts again. Too bad you can't fight malnutrition by hunting it down and killing it. So, first thing, insulation. First few right. nights, the soil right. was rock solid. Ended up having to insulate the damn place with dehydrated kelp. Adding a thermal mass helped, too. Heat from barrels of water. Probably should have just eaten the damned kelp, but nope. My body was craving a salad. Wish I was just made of exosuit. Next, grow lights were a must-have. Gotta admit, I felt pretty proud of my first full crop of lettuce. Fed half of it to Preston. That snow stalker will eat practically anything. Always spits half of it out, though. Another thing we have in common. The slobbery green mess makes good compost. Aww, he's sharing! I've already synthesized an antidote and stashed it in a cave. I can go grab it and... That's your plan? You don't think it'll work? <sighs> You're thinking too small. Like maybe if you're polite enough about destroying the bacteria, Altera will come around and see it your way. But do you believe in yourself or not? I think so. You think so? Come on! Is a bacteria a threat or isn't it? It is. Does it need to be dealt with or not? It does. So who's right on this? I am. Say it like you mean it. I, I am. I, I am? Said, Question like mark? you mean it, not like you're testifying before a rigged transgov court. I am. Right. Then what you gotta do, you can look all you want. There's more to Marguerite than any damn fangled gadget can see. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Uh, accidentally interrupted that last fucking uh thing though um shit no oh gee i never tried scanning her <laughs> you gotta check everything lupus you gotta check everything Uh huh. So it's not in research. Ian team, no. Oh, it's literally in her own thing. Hmm. 
Discharge from TSF. We're going off mission. Left home at 16. Holy fuck. Oh, that's fucked up. Basically a child soldier. Oh, wow. Yikes. Yikes. Head of the Intel and Recon mission, but silently eliminated the entire local security over three days. No local families would give more information. They only said they thanked God's hand for saving them. Margaret. Margaret, apparently. Um, where was it? Uh, she was in a colony exploited, exploited for its mineral resources, so any colony. Left home at 16 and went from one mercenary job to another. So that, yeah. I mean, I would say old child, like older child soldier, but I would still say that's pretty much a child soldier. Yeah, I think the, it's just a couple of friends. All right, we were basically at the end of it anyway, so it's no big deal. Um, we haven't listened to this log. Right, because we picked up the other one, so we'll play uh, that real quick. I can only do repairs in spurts. That's so inefficient. The larger tools seem to set off seismic activity nearby. A crew came back telling stories of gigantic worms burrowing in the ice. I don't know what they were going on about. They were hypothermic and frostbit because they walked back to avoid angering them. The ice shelf is probably a bit unstable and they got disoriented or something. To borrow from Diana. Orion's belt, thermocouplings, are not meant to be worked on in 20 minute spurts. If we break the process, we'll break the ship. <sighs> but it's nice to hang out with Yasmin while we wait for the rumbles to stop. I hope she doesn't mind all my questions. I love hearing her voice. Her face lights up, and she's got the most expressive eyebrows. They're practically acrobats. The way she looks when talking about nuclear engineering is the same way I look at my grandmother's domades. The woman never sits down, though. She told me that she used to do decathlon in college, and I can believe it. She's like a bouncy ball, just all over the place. She makes rounds on the ship every day to see if people need help. Hmm. I should do something nice for her. She's always helping everyone else. I wish I had a fraction of her energy. <laughs> One thing I do like in this game is a lot of the other personnel, like logs of them, are not just like caricature evil corpo capital stuff like some of these people are really nice and caring and I, f I feel like it adds a better dimension like that's very sweet hi dragon hey fish sticks uh there's plenty of fish out here uh we haven't seen any sticks though it's just all ice so i don't know i don't know if we'll find any of your comrades not most as twirpling twirling corporate clogs they feel more like people yeah this guy did maybe but yeah yeah play the mystics now that makes me think of breadsticks and then that makes me think of the fact that uh i haven't been to a texas roadhouse in forever and i want to eat <laughs> uh, what was I saying? Uh, Texas Roadhouse, and I really want some of that cinnamon uh, honey butter. That kind of crowd. Ah! No! Ah, shit, it's the government! It's the government! Watch out, everyone! What the fuck? Oh, no! 
Welcome on by. Oh, fuck. The government's on to us, everyone. Oh, a double ra- All right. Okay, people. I see, I see how it is. Hello, Gub. Hello, Chimera. I, y'all, y'all crashed in so fast. Um, so I can, I can use my button for one. So we'll use that. Uh, if y'all arrived from the Chimera zone, um, and are not following them, you need to fix that. You can go ahead and go over there and you can hit follow. And then you can come right back here and vibe. Uh, holy shit, so many people, so many people, ah. Uh, Bem and Gum, uh, welcome to the Ziggurat. I hope you enjoy your time here. Welcome on by Crystal Zina and hey, Manhunter, Azure Cradle, nice, nice. Nessie Darkness, ah, Puppet Tech, welcome to the Ziggurat. <laughs> um, and then I need to do a manual one for, uh, where is that cat? Did I get hit by a cat? XT Honey Hunt, how are you doing? <laughs> I am, I am, ah! I'm, I'm getting a whole fistful of stuff thrown at me, and I'm trying to shout out the government. Um, let's see if this works. All right, it did not do what I wanted. Oh, you might not have, there might not be a clip in range. That's probably why. Duh. But hey, um, streaming is hard work. I don't know how long y'all went, but it is now y'all's opportunity to sit back, relax, go leave a piss, take a water, probably from someplace different than you just piss. I mean, I mean, I'm, in a, I'm playing Subnautica and there's water everywhere. So you could probably just like take a, take a couple gulps from, the, from here instead. Um, but, uh, I, if you don't know me, am Drekki Ormer. I am the Draconic Serpent, the Flightless Dragon, or simply a worm here on the internet. You drink my tank water? No! I need it for my gulp! Um, uh, around me today are my critters. Uh, I, I've been working this week to upgrade them from simple PNGs, uh, and now they are all proper video tube PNG tubers. So I thought I would put them on screen rather than usually, usually I'd have them off screen and they would just kind of slide in and then do their jabbing and then slide off. Uh, they're all around, so we got the uh, we've got the owl up here in the right. Um, in the bottom left, there's the golem, and then at the very bottom is the fox. And they do they do they little they do little stuff. Uh, all all the audio things randomly pick one of them to do the speaking. Um, if you have if there's any issues with the voices, uh, please let me know. I'm trying to tweak them to be distinct but not difficult to hear. <laughs> Wee! Wee! Just little guys. Exactly, Lupus. Exactly. Ah! Fucking hitting me with my own worm on a string spear. Can't believe you do this to me. Welcome to the Ziggurat, Vado Bones. I hope you enjoy your time here. Um. Uh, just a uh, heads up. Uh, Subnautica Below Zero exclusive. Oh, thank you for the boot. Exclusively well, takes place in a giant I'm water world. Um, are you ready to rest? Well, if you've got a raid and run, absolutely no problem. Uh, <laughs> wow. Thank you, Fox. Thank you, Bem and Gum. Uh, but if you have to raid and run, absolutely no problem. Get you that rejuvenating Eep and have a great rest of your evening. Yeah, warning to anyone, uh, Subnautica, uh, is exclusively underwater. So if you have fear, uh, if you have thalassophobia, fear of like water, un being, like deeps of water, things like that, um, this is your heads up. Thank you for stopping on by. I play different things depending if it's Monday, Friday, or Saturday. Um, and maybe I'll see you around another time. You gonna enjoy the tea, Oni, maybe? Ooh. Ah, uh, there's a lot of good teas, so I hope y'all have a fantastic time. And I know if Leone made it, uh, it's gonna be made with a whole lot of love, because that lion has got a big heart. Be going for over 12 hours? Holy shice! Chimera, I know you're an amalgamation of many entities, but I don't think any of them can exist without sleep and rest. 
Uh, so I would recommend you indulge yourself in the sweet, sweet oblivion that is the Eeps. Um, but also, Subnautica Below Zero is the sequel to the first game, uh, Subnautica. <laughs> Uh, so if you haven't played this game, there's a few changes. Uh, the tech progression has been different. Some of the things have different recipes. Um, a completely different map. Um, character, like it actually has a focused specific plot line we've been going through. Um, but we just got through a major portion. So I'm not exactly too sure where to go next other than perhaps down. Um, but before I go down, my inventory is clogged with a bunch of random bollocks. So let's unfuck it by making a wall locker. Um, boop, boop. And then I'll get some more titanium. And then I will... Check out the habitat builder. We will build, clear out all of these because it bugs me whenever I have those little C alert things. Ah! Hydrate! I will hydrate. Plant, plot, plant, plot! Oh, I think I've got a headpath. How's the game been so far? It has been very interesting. Um, I was kind of stuck for a little bit at the start of the stream on progression. Um, a little, a little annoyed in how I was stuck. I had to find a laser cutter to get more progression, but I hadn't found any anywhere. Um, wasn't liking that, but, uh, we finally got through it. We've been progressing. Um, I don't know how much I like the truck. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> lupus clap pot indeed. <laughs> uh, doesn't sound fun. At least you got eventually. <laughs> what did that one read? <laughs> I mean, it was a good jam. Stretch. Oh, I can do. Um, what else? The creatures have been very interesting. Um, certainly like that. Uh, music is still A+. Plus, so still loving the sound design. Um, I mean, uh, maybe, maybe I haven't gotten, because I know there's some stuff apparently I can build that attaches to the truck. But I will say, so far, I don't like the truck compared to the, um... C thing in the first game. I'm suddenly forgetting its name. Um... Not the Sea Glider. Sea Moth, thank you. Sea Moth, yeah. I just feel like the Sea Moth was more, like, aesthetically pleasing. I liked its shape. I liked that it had a giant thick cargo hold I could shove things into. Um, I don't, I don't have a cargo hold I can put into the sea truck. Um, the prawn was a lot earlier to get, but I don't have my hook shot. So that kind of sucks. The storage module is specifically to the prawn rather than being prawn or the truck. Um, but like I see, I have ooh, spicy fruit salad. Interesting. Um, there is so like docking module, fabricator, sleeper. Sort of, so it seems like the sea truck is more designed to be a mobile base, perhaps, which is fine. Exclamation uh, mark! Lurk. <laughs> thank, thank you for letting me know that tapes is gonna lurk, everyone. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I, it's a it's a very crude uh, way I implemented it, so it's kind of picking up any message. <laughs> but thanks for stopping on by, tapes. I hope you have a good time 
foraging for delicious stuffs. Thanks for stopping on by. Um. Ah! Stay away! Oh, it fucking tased me. God damn it. Hello, thank you. I am here to wish you a good night, for I cannot stay and must I 37 sleepy. <laughs> Hey, Ice. Thanks for stopping on by. Get you some amazing rejuvenating heap. You must hear Crater as well. Yes. I finished overhauling them. So I have them all over the place at the moment. Although obviously I am finding various bugs that I did not properly account for. But I will need to fix those for tomorrow because tomorrow I want to use them specifically for things. Yeah, yeah, because they're actually each of them is um, a video tube instance. Um, so I actually have like three video tube windows open rather than just being a flat uh, PNG loaded into OBS. And that way I don't have to like manually animate like the blinking and stuff. It can stay nice and versatile. Fantasy truck is more versatile. How many programs do I have open right now? Let's see. Speaker bot, streamer bot, OBS, throwing system, VTube studio, video tube times three, um, Subnautica. It's like nine programs just for streaming. What did that? Damn, Lupus, you can't just talk about smashing people's butts. <laughs> I think they try to get that sort of functionality with the C-Track, but allow you to be able to pick and choose and not always be a huge behemoth smashing your butt into things. You kind of make a mobile bus with the Cyclops, kitted the hell out of you. Yeah, I mean, the Cyclops was just really fucking fun to drive. Like, it's just this big honking submarine you know, you have all these cameras you can look out of, like... I enjoyed that ship. That was a really fucking fun ship. I didn't realize it was going to be, like, a legit submarine when I built it, but I just see them, like, going off further and further into distance and then constructing it. I'm like, oh. Oh. But yes, thanks for stopping on by, Ice. It is always fantastic to see you. And I hope you have a wonderful, restful, amazing. <laughs> but yeah, the biggest thing for getting the critters to work is with um, the... Um, actually, her dog's not... Wait. How did... Is she going to be back here? We need to go in here because uh, maybe we can get into her room this time. Um, but, um, I'm doing a start of stream tomorrow, uh, will be our first instance of the web serial book club I want to do every couple of weeks. And I wanted to have the critters to be able to, like, narrate some hmm. stuff. Do you have something for me? I am the leader now! Is it chewing on a... Adorable. <laughs> Stand on her head, assert dominance. Exactly! Ooh, I'm gonna get a shower. Nice. You can build all the amenities. Depots. Exactly. Well, y you gotta have a fridge. I think we already have the coffee maker, so we don't gotta worry about that. All right. Um, cool. Uh, 
Uh, uh, nothing else here. Abandoned PDA. All right, that's number three, but where's number one? Where's log number one? In the dining room? In the dining room thing. What about it? Something in the lantern tube? I think it's just various light things. Not seeing any uh, indicators of other stuff to scan. Um, just the license of yes. Uh, her pantry is uh, a bit of a mess. <laughs> Fucking chewing on one of those power tablets. <laughs> Look like a PDA for a blue fashion. Mm. Certainly don't want to miss any PDAs. Which is why I'm annoyed that I don't know where I missed the first Margaret one. We have two and three, but we're missing number one. Fuck it, we'll just that listen far to him. To see, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. From the noise, exactly. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. Three so liters of water? Of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much, but I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And Damn. I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. Ah, damn. Also, thank you for the head pads. And I can't believe you slapped me with the the, the Drecky snail and then threw us into the void. Ah, oh, it's the boy! All right, let's get number three playing. Fortnite into our voyage. I was more or less living in. No, the gnomes will drown. It meant oh, the bread's gonna get soggy. The flesh was starting to rot. The stench is unlike anything I'd ever smelled. Ow. <laughs> what the fuck? Chimera, thank you. Thank you for the mana. Thank you for the hundred mana. <laughs> Oh. Almost imperceptibly, the Reaper began to. I never, I never know what to say on, on, Sanctuary on the bits day. things. My sanctuary has become a tomb. I was at the mercy of the current and the winds. Until one day, Just hitting me with all sorts of I mana saw chips. Smattering of penguins in the distance. Swimming birds usually mean solid land of some kind. I was lucky. The winds followed their path. Hours later, I saw a blessed sight. An unmoving cloud sitting upon the water. Land. It renewed my spirit as I watched ah! the land get closer and closer. The Reaper started to sink. Arrow Lucy? But I was no longer worried. Welcome to the Ziggurat. I hope you enjoy your time here. When the Reaper finally sank below the water, I was close enough to lazily swim my way to shore. The crystals in this environment are confusing my senses. And yet I feel certain there is something important below. A facility or a body component. Perhaps both. I cannot tell. 
So funny, funny, you raided a second apart with someone else. That was oh, that wasn't? I thought y'all coordinated. <laughs> I guess, uh, I guess it was just y'all, uh, just a night. The night for Raiden. Hmm. Nope. Ooh, environment change. We have now entered the green zone. People just want to hang out with a cute boopable snake. That is a lot of kyanite, and I have not seen any reason for us to need this much kyanite. Device? Interesting. You got to write five minutes sooner, but people tried postponing your ending. <laughs> oh. Again, Lupus. Can't believe you would boot me like this. Ach, mein snoots. Holly cage. What is this? Is this is this where the the BDSM polycules go? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I think this is a dead end. Oh, it's a thing to scan. Interesting. Someone in a poly relationship. I take sarcastical offense to that. <laughs> like the sea truck, but you like the sea moth more. Yeah, yeah, I kind of like the sea moth more. I don't know. Maybe I'll like the sea truck when I actually find the last bits and can build it out more. But right now, as a stub, really think the sea moth is cooler. And this area is like really rich in materials and I don't know why. But it's just not a style. Kind of a barnacle of event, yeah. The trick is definitely more convenient, but it's just not that. Yeah. happy I finally had enough people to raid though. Ah, it's never, it's never about the number of people that are raiding. Um, that's one of the reasons I've actually taken off. Uh, Cause like for a while I was like showing like how many people that were coming in from a raid, but I decided I don't, I don't really like that. Cause I don't, I don't want that to be a focus or any attention to be drawn to that. So it's just about someone leading their people over to the ziggurat. Highlighting the person who did the raid more than anything. So it's, it's, it's one of the fun things of raiding is try is trying to connect uh, different communities together. You know, uh, I've found a lot of cool people purely through raids and, you know, I like doing that too for uh, others. It is a big internet out there, and you don't know what you don't know. Just like I don't know how to go down when I don't know where there is to go, that's down. Hmm. I miss sonar. Gotta be some place that lets me go further down. It ended up here a raid weeks ago. I've not been able to leave the Ziggurat's down. <laughs> well, it is spatially folded into a hidden space of the jungle. So, you know, uh, that is a bit on me. Um, it's a defense mechanism, you know, so uh, 
know, no one, no one unscrupulous folks have trouble discovering us. Ah, fair enough. You always worry over doing raids. Never done one. Never been downed before raiding with a low number. I mean, I've certainly raided with probably like nobody before. I would say I certainly feel intimidated by like bigger channels. I've there's been a couple times where I just went super long and was not thinking and I accidentally went into some way bigger channels like, oh, this is I feel awkward as fuck. This is weird. I like just immediately like, oh, I got to go by. Raid, run, panic, trip, face plant. Try not to cry, cry deeply. Hmm, what if I just get out? Nope. Not seeing anything. Pretty sure I might already have that egg, but we'll see. Also of note, um, I still have like the starter oxygen tank because I never found the recipe for the, the second tier one. So that's fun. Found any grabbers? I've, my ship has certainly been grabbed by various entities. Yeah, intimidation is a big factor too, but I enjoy watching you and know my community. Aw. Thank you. I appreciate that. I certainly try to... Positivity is certainly something I want to exude or put out into the world. Uh, so it it always is nice that uh that gets that gets across to people. <laughs> Oh shit, this is the crystal case. Yeah, yeah, because I, I, I haven't gotten like distinct marker of where to go. But I've gotten a couple of messages of like, I see something and there's crystals everywhere, but it's blocking my stuff. So that's why I'm in the crystal caves. And I feel like I need to go down. No! Hey, boy. Hey, buddy. What's going on? Hmm. Shadow fish, my beloved. Shadow fish, my beloved. Nope, we are not saying hi to the boy. What the? F ah! God. Fuck. Damn it. Yep. Uh-huh. 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 I guess I guess he could get me there. <sighs> you know, I've heard of sucking face, but I feel like it's going a few bases too far too fast. I feel like I should at least be taken to the movies and a dinner first. Honestly, I considered recently quitting and my good friend had to reassure me. I'm glad she did, otherwise I wouldn't have gotten had the fun I did today. Aww. Ah, yeah, can't avoid that. Streaming is definitely different for everyone. Um, definitely nothing wrong if you need to take a break or if the reasons you wanted to stream have changed. I'm pretty sure if it grabs us again, our ship is destroyed. So I'm going to fuck. I am literally dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead, man. 
Y'all, I it has been Warning. so long since I last saved. Remaining. So so long. Oxygen. Oh! No, I don't I don't have resources to build an emergency shelter or anything like that. I'm just DED dead. He be taxing, but I do it to make people smile. That hasn't changed. Just confidence issue. Ah. Uh. Have fun with Monhan. Certainly an interesting franchise. I don't know. I don't. I, I didn't really like the Wire Bug, so I never really got Rise or played uh, too much further past Iceborne. Also, I speak the truth. Chimera is small. <laughs> Yeah, that's certainly one thing about streaming, because, you know, you're you're putting a piece of you're putting a piece of yourself out there and you don't know who is going to see you, how they're going to see you or how it will be interpreted by others. Um, it is a little a little scary sometimes thinking about that. Um. But there were a lot of streamers who have entertained and helped me through some harder times. And uh, I hope that some somehow sometimes I can alleviate people's day and, you know, maybe inspire them. I don't know. Um, we have to rebuild our truck. All right, we have a power cell. I think we have the ingot. So I think we have everything we need at our other base, except glass. What do we need for glass? Quartz. Uh, hmm. I've been technically doing streaming for 10 years on the golf. This channel is new. Old ones I kindly abandoned. Oh, wow. That's certainly a long time to be creating and putting yourself out there. certainly do not have that much experience under my belt. Oh, man. This is... I'm not gonna lie, people. This is gonna be a bit rough. I've heard of La Squishy. That was your first. usually not good at remembering names and I wasn't I'm fairly new to really paying attention on Twitch like I think my I think I originally had an account on back when it was just in TV but I didn't really start like watching streamers until um, the last couple years. Just from a time and awareness. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Hey, Arya. Welcome on by. I hope you're having a good evening. My thing, like, 
is I wanted to have some kind of thing on screen that was me, but I didn't want to do a camera. Which So for the longest time, that's why I was like, I'd like to do some streaming, but I don't want to put myself visible. And then I found out about like VTuber and PNG tuber stuff. And it's like, oh, that's perfect. And then that took a while to do a whole bunch of research and then get that thing situated. Whale! Certainly a whale of a time. Warning, passing 100 meters. Oxygen. Miles extremely cute and props whoever made it. Uh, the person who made it is Sapphire or Shadow Fox, depending on what platform you encounter them on. He does a lot of really great uh, creations. All right, so let's see. We have power cell. Um, I just sworn I had an advanced wiring kit somewhere. Fuck me! That means I lost my modules too. Ah! I Uber as well, so I can see the one for it. Uh, why am I not following you though? <laughs> That's no problem. Look, I once was subbed to a person for like four months before realizing I wasn't following them. So, <laughs> um, but hey, Ari, I hope you're having a fantastic evening. PNG tuber interview too. I mean, I have a PNG tuber as well. Um, because like. There's pros and cons to Live 2D and to PNG Tuber. I've seen a lot. I've seen people with only PNG PNGs do a lot of really creative and interesting things with it. Um, you know, uh, all sorts of stuff. Um, and then I've also seen people do a lot of creative things with YouTube Studio. It's just sort of uh, how you want to express yourself. Um, you can do a lot of different things depending on uh, whichever it is. And 3D, and I mean, and yeah, and then there's 3D as well. Um, I would like to have also a 3D. I would like just in general to have more forms, but it just takes a while to to create and even think of them. Uh, let's see. All right, first things first, we need the damn thing built. Thankfully, I have exactly enough glass. I need the lead. Three lead. A cat model, an elven looking character based on your TV stuff. Ooh. The D in D's. I believe the advanced wiring kit needs a normal wiring kit and then a computer chip, which needs coral, copper, and gold. And copper. All right. Now we make the computer chip. These two. Ah. Nice. All right, so we have that. Uh, we need to make that. We need to make that. I hate everything, man. I hate everything. I guess I should have just built that fucking afterburner. Oh, and I'm going to need enameled glass after all. Well, fuck. 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 
Fuck, fuck, fuck. <sighs> Need so much shit. I put it here. All right. So let's see. Rubies. Actually, what do I need for the enameled? More diamonds. Fuck. Man, that set us back. Oh, blood and ashes. Beacon dropped beacon. Oh, oh, that's one of the things I dropped. I lost my beacon. Too bad I can't go back and like pick up my corpse and get everything back. Um, VTuber looks like someone I would make a warlock pact with. <laughs> Doesn't it look like a cookie? Which thing? Let's see. The vents are by base for later. 22 cookies, snake with feathers. Not the same colors, but same inspiration. Oh, Cookie is a dragon character from Ah, okay. Gotcha. Um, I did see. Okay, so we have that. We have the rubies. I just need. Basically everything for the enameled glass. Really, honestly, I think that is my biggest complaint of the blueprint changes. Enameled glass is such a pain in the dick to make now. I stole a name from my heritage, yes. All right, let's uh, surface and make our damn ship just so we can move faster. Just call him Cookie for short. I mean, that makes sense. Perfect little reason, but uh, Okay, let's make the uh vehicle. Cannot build here. Must be constructed in deeper water. Man, we're gonna be doing this again. There we go. Air feather server, green main body, red feather like antennae that moves with reaction. Uses telepathy and such. Oh. I see, I see. What do think you can do, but it's a bit finicky? Pray tell. Thankfully, I have all that extra kyanite I grabbed. Otherwise, I would basically just have to go down with my prawn, I guess. I guess I should maybe bring stuff down there to build a new base. 
Just to have a checkpoint? I don't know. I don't really see any good places to build bases down there. If I'm honest. Do not fuck with me. I will cry. <laughs> it be it do be how it be doing uh. stretch that is a good idea It's the turkey plushie. And the hydrate. <sighs> Delicious. Delicious wawa. All right, so here's the volcanic zone. Love how I keep coming here, like, in the darkness. Definitely the best time to be here, where everything is super dark and hard to see, and, you know. Warning. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Fuck! Why is there no diamonds?! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm so mad. Ugh. Quispy dwecky. Misty! That's a spicy snack. Fucking drive my truck. Find some fucking diamonds. In fact, the crevices are completely empty as bullshit. Oh, oh, this one's stocked with gold? Man, fuck you. I don't need your fucking gold. Need your diamonds. Oh, finally, some diamonds. Ugh, I need so many. I would love to, like, just fill my inventory with them. Finally, some good fucking food. Exactly. Thank you, Lu Our Luki. Lucy. And thank you, critters. Speaking only the tooth, and nothing but the tooth. Calorie intake recommended. Fucking... How about... Fucking intake my fist into your face. Got him. I know there's more... Areas. Hmm. Uh, where was that way I went to get in? Hmm. 
Yeah, I've gotten in there once with my truck. Let's see. Actually, I can go just go in the front door again and then navigate outwards because I know where the thing is from within. Here, I think. Yeah. Yes, intended. <laughs> exactly. More fucking gold. Lamb's gold in these walls. <sighs> Lot of gun. There's gold everywhere. Can't find any diamonds. Look, more fucking gold. This rate, Otacon will never be able to stop the Metal Gear. Oh no, the Metal Gear is coming! Flee! Hey, Glottal. I hope you're having a fantastic evening. And if y'all ever need a good evening to have you should first check to see if Glottal is live because then you can go over there and you will have a good evening. <laughs> right, let's see. Let's eat a granola bar. Vital signs stabilizing. Let's get crumbs all over our dang sea truck. Why is there so much gold? Is this game made by Capcom? What is this desire sensor? Like I'm playing Monster Hunter. Ooh, diamonds. Finally. All right, let's wait for it to go away so I don't die. Good shit. Back? Well, come on back. Ooh, more diamonds. Uh, can I fit all of those? Yes, I can. All right, we'll, we'll wait for the next uh, explosion, and then I'll jump out, grab the diamonds, and then we will cheese it. All right, time to cheese it. I think that was the wrong way to go. Now I have a new problem, getting my dang truck out through all these tight spaces. My truck is thump dummy thick. It was that that moment Drucky realized they were completely and utterly lost. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Now we just gotta wiggle on out. Just wiggle on out. Just wiggle it out. It's been up since 9 a.m. It's about to be midnight. Dang it, Chimera! Get you some eat! Dang it! Dang nab it! Rest of my stream will definitely go fantastic because you stopped on by. <laughs> All 
remember going from plant to plant, just exploring all the area in here. I've certainly done like a big loop. I feel like there's probably a couple sections I haven't. No. No. I'm going to roll to disbelieve. Have a rejuvenating eat, Chimera. That's the opposite of a pat. That's a yeet. <laughs> One yeet before bed. One yeet before bed. <laughs> Not accidentally destroy our second one. Warning: passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. All right. Let's make some enameled glass. Um, drop this off. All right, we need lead and glass. I need to go get quartz. And lead. What the fuck? Well, I have more lead than that. Apparently not. Okay then, so we are gonna mark this with quartz. The squid shark C. Ex yeah. They really do be squidding around. Ooh, a piece of candy. 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 Oh, I've never scanned this? Interesting. And this has been like the perfect base. There's been all sorts of resources very close by. Leave me alone! No touchy! Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Other than our neighbors, I mean, geez! On the edge of the map. Uh, yeah, yeah. Still, still terrifying. Still terrifying. Am I not really in range of any lead? Huh. Interesting. Uh, research, geological, silver, gold. 
So I want Galena outcrops. Galen out cross my beloved. Ow! Fuck! Stop it! <laughs> what the fuck, game? What are you doing? Also, why could I not get that damn outcrop? <laughs> 